Hello everyone, welcome back to me playing Skyrim Special Edition. Um, I managed to run back to uh, Helgen and get myself an axe, just so it looks proper. And then uh, I managed to catch back up with Hadvar here before he took off to wherever it is he's going to end up going. So, we're not going to miss any bit of story, even though we wouldn't really miss much. So, I'm, a. Uh... Oh, there we go. That's how you turn the camera. I am a lizard man. Totally inspired from, what's it called, uh, Soul Calibur. I guess. Anyways. May as well get more of this talking out of the way. This is probably going to be another, like, dialogue-heavy episode and that ta that plate is freaking out I don't know if it's supposed to do that oh it's it's his plate now now it's the floor's plate There are a lot of animal heads in this cottage, considering that... Well, I guess maybe... Maybe Alvar's wife is a hunter? Maybe? I don't know. There's a lot of animal heads in here. Not much more to tell. This dragon flew over and just wrecked the whole place. Mass confusion. I don't know if anyone else got out alive. I doubt I'd made it out myself, not for my friend here. I need to get back to solitude. Let's just not really do anything. Salt pile and cabbage. I food with that. Salt pile, worker meat. I've never actually really cooked anything in this game, mostly because your health regenerates so fast that you don't really need to. Oh. I'm glad to help in any way I can. But I need your help. We need your help. Alright, let's see if there's anything good in here. Nothing particularly, but we'll take all of it. Because we can sell what we don't need. For more starting money. Alright. So that's what we're gonna go do. We're gonna go talk to Jarl of Whiterun to let him know about these dragons. So I'm gonna be sticking as close to the main story as possible. So even though I know I should be going other places, or at least I know where to get specific things for the story, I'm going to be wait to be told to go get them instead of uh, doing them the other way. I guess I don't know. Basically, I'm gonna be playing out the main story. As if I've never played it before. Which means I'm not going to go over there to Bleak Falls Barrow. I'm going to go all the way to Whiterun. And then come all the way back to go to Bleak Falls Barrow. To get the thing I need. Right? So, uh, yeah. I guess I should have thrown spoilers in there somewhere, but... It's not really plot related so much as it is... Destination related? And, uh, you wouldn't know where that is if you've never played this game anyway, so... You kill a lot of wolves in this game. It makes me feel bad. Anyways. Uh, taking that nice Skyrim scenic view. I'm gonna run past these guys because even though I'm wearing their uniform, they don't recognize me. Or, wait, that made no sense. Either way. It's a nice, short walk to, uh... Whiterun, which is that big city there on the mountain, if you didn't know. 
Or is that even really considered a mountain? Maybe it's just like a hill? Rock formation? I don't know. Either way, that's Whiterun. And that's where we're going. Uh, on my way down here, I also picked the Warrior Stone, if I didn't already say that. Because I don't remember if I did. But, uh, that's what I'm doing. Ooh, there's a giant over here. Let's fight the giant. Oh, well, the giant's dead. Never mind. I have no interest in talking to the companions if they've already killed the giant, because they'll just tell me I'm not worthy. Which I don't really want to deal with right now. Could definitely use some more stamina, though, so I could run places faster. Anyways, let's get on into White Run. Any time now. Hold. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. I'm pretty sure you can't fail this, so I'm gonna go with persuade. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. Yay, speech increase. Level up. Oh. So we're now level 2, and because we're playing a warrior class, I'm going to go with health, and then I'm going to go stamina next time. But I'm also going to put... Hmm. One into one-handed skill. Why not? More damage. Um, everything seems a lot more vivid in here than I remember it being. Like, it's super colorful. Either way. We will head up to the castle. Right there. Dragon's Reach. Oop, don't need to take that out. I hate that sometimes, it probably just my controller, but sometimes when I push the sprint button it makes me draw my weapon, which is just slightly annoying. And I already went over how there's the whole toggles, toggle sprint thing. I'd rather it just be hold down and let go to stop sprinting. Yeah. Either way, so we're gonna get this whole conversation underway. I guess I should probably speak to answer questions. Let's see. I'll do that from now on. So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? Uh... The dragon destroyed Helgen, and last I saw it was heading this way. You do. You know, I could be wrong, but I don't remember all these banners being here before. Maybe it's just because everything's brighter now that I'm actually noticing them. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done white run a service. Well, technically I didn't, but oh well. Take this as a small token of my esteem. 
Imperial studded armor. That's nice. I think that's better than what I'm wearing. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He just sits in a way that makes him look like he doesn't care. It's kind of funny. Alright, so let's check out this armor real quick. Oh yeah, I forgot to sell stuff. Whatever. It is better, although it doesn't look much different. I think what I need to do is I also need to put a point into my smithing soon so that I can uh, upgrade the smithing and upgrade the armor that I'm going to be wearing. Because I don't want to be wearing Imperial armor all the time because it's not that great. So the old thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragon. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Mm -hmm. well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone. Those are all details, though. Nobody cares about the details. Straight all right, what am I fetching? No need for tedious hows and whys. I like that. Leave those details to your betters. Am I right? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Anything you can tell me about Bleak Falls Barrow? Built by the ancient Norse, perhaps dating back to the Dragon War itself. Ah, maybe you just want to know how to get there. Near Riverwood, a miserable little village a few miles south of here. I was just I there. Where some of the locals can point you in the right direction once you get there. How do I? How do you know the stone tablet is in Bleak Falls Barrow? Well, you must preserve some professional secrets, must we? I have my sources. Reliable. All right then. Hmm. Let's see what you got for sale. I, you figured for a mage. I think you'll appreciate this. I know I said I was going to use an axe. However, if he's got the bound sword spell, which he totally does, and I am just short, I need to sell something. Uh, that's not worth much. Oh yeah, the mage's robes. I can sell these. That'll get me where I need to go. I forgot to learn that as well. Anyways, so. Bound sword, because it's going to definitely help me increase my level really quickly. Because, And it's also a really good weapon. I like using it. We're going to go ahead and set that to my conjuration. Can I actually even cast it, now that I think about it? 82. Yeah, I'll be fine. Oh, thank you. Alright, well, cool. Now that that's all over and done with. Shut up, kid. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, now I'm going to head back to... I'll go to Riverwood, I guess, again. Oop, this is the world map, just in case you know. This is as far as we traveled. We actually started here. That's where we were going to get executed. And now we're all the way up here. And now we have to go all the way back to here. So I'm going to head back, fast travel back to Riverwood. And then that's where we'll pick up on the next episode. So uh, if you guys wouldn't mind, it'd be really cool if you liked, commented, subscribed. And possibly shared this with some other people that who might enjoy this kind of thing. I don't know. Up to you guys. Anyways... See you guys in the next video.